Oh, well, just inside for breakfast. Oh, what have you had some thanks? Oh, another cup of tea would be nice, though. Oh, you? Charity wants another cup of tea. There's plenty in the pot. I'm off to work. Do you fancy a walk, Charity? You could walk to work with me if you like. I've just got in. Fresh air might do you good. Oh, Kip's what I need, not fresh air. I didn't get much sleep last night. I'll see you later, then. Shouldn't you be at work? It's my lunch hour. You don't usually come home. You know why I'm here? No, not really. You and Chris Tate. It's none of your business. Well, I think it is. Normally, I'd be very pleased that you'd found yourself a boyfriend, but... <laughs> Why are you laughing? No reason. I'll tell you what, I'll explain one day when I've got a couple of hours to spare, right? Don't patronise me, please. Chris Tate is a very dangerous man. Not from where I'm standing. You don't understand Charity. He's an enemy to this family. Mr Dingle would be very distressed if he knew about it. No. Oh, no, not really. Not Mr Dingle. Stop it, Charity. You care about Lisa, don't you? Lisa would be very distressed too. Well, tough. They must count for something. They've taken you in like they've taken me in. They're good people. We owe them our loyalty. Wrong. I don't owe nobody nothing. And I don't like being preached at by little Miss Innocent who grew up on some farm and reckons it all dropped out at Sky. You know nothing about my life. Maybe I don't. But I'm finding out about it now, aren't I? Well, keep your nose out! I may have grown up on a farm, Charity. My life wasn't easy until I met Butch and this family. And you're part of this family. And now you're having a relationship with the man who was good as murdered Butch. Look, Emily, we're all sorry about Butch, but, you know, it's history. You've got to get on with your life. Will you just let me get on with mine? How am I supposed to do that? What am I supposed to do? Going about me work, going about home, knowing this about you, feeling sick inside, not being able to talk to anybody about it. Do you know what? We just get lost, Emily. Nothing doing. Then stop it for your own sake, Charity. For yourself. Cos you'll get hurt too. I know you will. What do you want? How did it earlier? When? What do you mean? Well, you and Emily were having some sort of an argument. What were you about? Well, what did you hear? Something about her knowing something about you and feeling sick about her not being able to tell no one. Oh, that. She... She caught me with a punter last night, didn't she? Silly little girl. She didn't know, did she? You mean... she thought you were a innocent little virgin like her? <laughs> Silly cow, eh? Yeah. Uh, Silly cow. What are you doing here? You're hurt. Kane knows. He's on his way over. Will you take Joseph upstairs, please? Go on, I'll come up and I'll explain later. Are you all right? Oh, God, he is now. So she's told him, then? Well, I didn't think she would. He'll kill us both. 
They phoned in terror. No, police. No, door. How far behind you was he? Um, for a few minutes. Police, please. No. You've got to get me out of here. You're perfectly safe. You can't get out. I'll have to lie low for a bit. We'll talk about it. I'll need money. I can arrange everything. It'll kill us, you know. You're safe here. Two chains and a bolt. You can't get in. Back door. It's not got a bolt. The police are right behind you, Kane. One finger on me and they've got you. Yeah, go on then, Kane. Kill him, but you'll just to kill Luke first. Grab him. Go with me. I'll get you. You and that tart. I love you both. Get him out. You all right now? Yeah. You stepped in front of me. Did I? Yeah. You wanted to kill me. You stepped in front of me. Well, I never did like being at the back of a queue. <laughs> Might have killed you instead of killing me. He didn't know, did he? Why did you do it? Just boned after, I suppose. Are you still sure about not pressing charges? Have you seen what they do to people like me in a courtroom? I can imagine. And think of the fun they'd have with you. No, oh, I'd go through with it if you said the word. I've had worse. I better go while I can. Where will you go? Not back to the Dingles. Find somewhere. If you can help out. Well, yeah, of course. I'd rather you stayed here. With Zoe and Joseph? Yeah, I'll deal with Zoe. Yeah? I mean it. I'll make it right with Zoe. And you... You can have your own room. You really mean it? You're asking me to stay here at home farm? Yeah. Well, just for one night. I would like that, actually. All right, then. Thanks. Well...